Lesson 11 deals with different types of rests. We're using 4-4 four, four time just for the sake of this assignment. The duration of musical silence is indicated by different types of rests. So if you want four beats of rest, you draw this little rectangle below the line. If you want two beats of rest, you draw it above the line. And if you want one beat or a quarter rest, you draw it a little squiggle. So this just kind of shows you how they equal each other. One whole rest, so four beats, equals two half rests, two plus two, right? So there you are. One half rest, two beats, equals two quarter rests, which are each one beat. So the whole one whole rest, four beats here, equals four quarter rests, one plus one plus one plus one, okay? In four four time, so that means we have four beats in every measure. A whole rest receives four beats. One, two, three, four. These receive two beats. Quarter rests are one beat apiece. So each of these measures should have four beats in it. The combination of notes and rest produces sound and silence within a musical uh, composition song. Fill in the missing beats with the appropriate rests. Use only one rest in each measure. Some measures may already be complete. Okay, so we're in 4-4 four, four time. We're trying to get to 4. So we have 2 plus 1. We need one more to make 4. So I'm going to draw that, okay? And you don't have to write the numbers underneath. I'm just doing that. Um, 1 plus 1 is 2. We're trying to get to 4. So we're going to write a half rest above the line. This one's already done. This is 4 beats, right? 1 plus 2. Um, we need one more, okay? We need one more here. Number two, fill in the missing beats with the appropriate notes. Use only one note in each measure. Some measures may already be complete. So now we're going back to notes, not rests. Okay, two plus one, we need one more. So I'm gonna do another quarter note. One plus one, we're only using one note. So I need a half note for two. One plus one plus two is four, I'm trying to get to four. This is already four, nothing needs to be done. One plus two, I need one more beat in this one. I need one more beat in this one. And I need one more beat in that one. Number three, fill in the missing beats with either notes or rests. Use as many as you wish to make it complete. So this can be whatever you want. I'm going to uh, one plus two, I need one more, so I'll make a rest. Um, I could do a half rest. And I can do a quarter rest or a quarter note here. So you can play with that. Draw the brace, draw the treble clef, draw the bass clef, and draw the notes indicated. If the pitch indicated can be drawn in more than one place on the staff, choose which one you want to write. Um, so these, E, I'm going to, you can put it wherever you want. I'm gonna put it on the low bass. I know that that's an E. And it says to draw a quarter note, so I've got to fill in this note head. Quarter note. B, I can draw it here. The stem goes down when it's on the third line. G, you can draw it wherever you want. We'll just do it here for good measure. Okay, and then D. I don't know what's the... Every good boy, or good boys do, fine, always. It's on the third line, so I need to draw my stem going down. And now half notes for these ones. So half notes, whole note for wherever you want to put the A, you can put in the space, half notes, quarter notes, whole note. And then number four sets or five says to add the time signature. So you're going to write four, four up here and down here and then draw the bar lines. So make sure that you draw the bar lines. Um, so an F we could put it right there. So when the measure is complete, just draw the bar lines and then draw a double at the end. 